Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Erica or Ricky Mickey Plans and I'm here to plan so I hope you're here to plan with me. I'm planning this week in my classic size happy planner for the week of March 15th to the 21st. This should be a quick video this week, at least that's what I'm imagining. So let me get this out of the way and kind of show you why it's going to be a quick week because for us it is spring break and so I don't have very many plans because you know it's break. So I'm excited about that. And I'm going to make this an easy plan with me. At least that's the hope because I'm going to use this sticker, maybe both of them, and the stickers in this book that match it, maybe one other book and some washi and that's it. I'm not planning to make my own stickers. I'm not planning to dig through a thousand books. I'm trying to keep it simple. So this is the green student book that this little guy is in, who is generally too bright for me, but it's spring break. I'm gonna go bright, it's okay. So now I just have to decide where to put these guys. Uh, top or bottom, that's really it, right? Left or right, top or bottom, those are my only choices, aren't they? So I think I'm definitely going to put one down here in this bottom corner. I'm just gonna pull him across as straight as I can get him. Oh yeah, cute, cute. And even though spring break is kind of technically just the weekdays, this sticker is long enough that it's gonna go into Saturday, but I'm gonna go ahead and use it on the other side because what am I saving it for? Another spring break? That's a long way off. I'm just gonna use it. Honestly, I think I've had these stickers for, I don't know how long I've had them, but I know I've had them for a while, so there's no sense saving them any longer. So. That is my beginning. So there you go. And then like I said, I'm just gonna kinda go with the stickers in this book that match it, which is mostly this page, but there are a few more. And I've got a bunch of washi. This washi, can you believe how well it matches that? It's almost perfect. Love that. And then I just got a few, pulled a few glitters in the colors. And so I may use those too, we'll see. I don't know yet. But like I said, since I'm making this easy, I'm going to pick a sticker to put up here. And I think I'm going to go with, it's not really spring, but it's spring break. So I'm gonna go with, it's a bright spring, do your thing. See that, like magnetically stuck there. And put that guy right there, sort of like a theme sticker spot. And then I usually like to put something down here and down here. So let's do that. What else can I put? Are you on screen with this? Yes. Um, I'm going to put the black one over here. Don't really know why. Just am. So I'm going to put this one down here. It's not really the size of the box. Do you notice that? I think the student books must have shorter boxes because, see? But it's okay, I don't mind that, that doesn't bother me. And then one for down here. Follow your heart, good vibes. That's too many stripes, I think. I'm gonna go with love this season. Tea party was the only one I was never gonna use. So, I mean, not never, but never for this spread. That's what I meant. I have nothing against tea parties, they're fun. Of course, my daughter's too old for a tea party. My daughter, <laughs> she didn't used to have tea parties. She had soup parties. So we we had a tea set like every, you know, like tons of little girls have. But she would have soup parties. It was a blast. It, I mean, she just cracked me up. I loved her imagination, you know? All right, so let's see. This will still happen, this will still happen. Calcanite will not because it's spring break. So I'm going to move this post-it over here and not put a box. Dance practice will not happen. It is spring break. Can't put it there. Got to put it in the next page, which is over there. Violin lesson, I don't think happens next week because her teacher is on spring break. Um, dance practice, again, will not happen. Spring break. So I just got rid of a ton of things to do. That feels good. Um, there are a few things that I want to put down with boxes, and like I said, since I'm sticking mostly with this book, 
I'm gonna use the boxes that are in it, which are right here. So, let's see here. They're mostly big boxes, so I may end up going to my colorful boxes book, but I'm still close to telling you the truth. Um, there's something on Monday that I want to remember. It's nothing I have to be at, so I just wanna mark it just to remember it. So I'm gonna use one of these smaller ones, I think. Actually, I think I might put some shiny washi at the top. That's where I have to pick a color. Which color? The pink, the turquoise, the light blue, or the green? I think I'm gonna go with the green. All right, so I like the green. Now I just need to decide what I wanna put at the top. So let's test it. That's pretty. That doesn't do it for me. That's fun. Which one? Are you thinking turquoise? I'm thinking turquoise. Let's do turquoise. Okay, what do you think? I love it. I love it. It's not grass and sky, it's just fun, and I like it a lot. I'm very happy with it. All right, so now I'm gonna choose this pink guy for the little reminder I mentioned for Monday. Just a little something I want to remember that day. So I'm gonna put that there. And then we do still have trash night and shot night. Should I use a cute one for that? No, yeah, no, yeah, I don't know. What's wrong with me? I don't, I'm acting silly and I don't need to act silly. I think I'm gonna use a little one just because, you know, it's not, it's trash night and shot night. It's nothing that amazing, right? So let's go with this periwinkle one. I'll put shot and trash down here. I put it at the end of the day because, you know, it's kind of the last thing we usually think about. And we like to do the shot right before bed because, you know, side effects and all that. Okay, so that's shot and trash night. Um, like I said, my husband does have a church meeting. I'm gonna make that a cute happy sticker just because I can. So let's see here. Let's do the teacup for that just because it's cute. And because I don't have green on Monday yet. So I'm gonna put that here. I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna put it here. I don't think we'll have anything else Sunday night, so I'm just gonna do that. All right, so move that sticker to next, that post-it to next week. Um, do you have two game nights? Wait, is there anything else? Let's see here. I'm glancing over at my calendar. Do you wanna mark that my son won't have classes on Tuesday? It doesn't really matter to me. He lives a thousand miles away but it means I can call him if I want to, or, you know, just say, have a good day or something. I can just, you know, leave him a little text. So I do want to mark that that is their, what are they calling it? Wellness day. His college is still um, virtual, like all online classes, and they are realizing how hard that is. And so they're giving them like a wellness day, like once every two or three weeks where there are no classes. They still have homework, but no classes. Oh, uh, yeah. This day is St. Patrick's Day, so I do want to mark that, and I think there was a sticker in here for that. There's this guy, but I don't know if he goes with it, does he? It's kind of the wrong green, don't you think? So I don't think I want to use that. So I'm gonna go with this little guy here. St. Patrick's Day is not gigantic where I live, so that little sticker will do. I'll just put that there, that's fine. Actually, I could, no, it's fine. It's fine, Erica, it's fine. My daughter might still, I don't know, that dance practice I don't think is happening, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Two game nights, I'm gonna use these two smaller stickers because I know exactly when those are, so I don't need to write a whole lot on those. So we'll have a Thursday night game night. 
and we'll have a Friday night game night. And we do those online still, but vaccinations are coming, so we may be able to meet with those soon. My post-its are in the wrong spot. They're Thursday and Friday, not Friday and Saturday. I just did that wrong when I moved them. So this week I'll move them right. Thursday, Friday, there we go. Church, we have several things to mark down. So I'm gonna get a nice big sticker. I guess I'll go with pink, I don't know. No, I really like the bicycle. Nope, pink, I'm just... See, this is not important, this is just fun, right? So... This will be for church because I've got several things to write. I've got our worship service, our fellowship, and there's also a business meeting. Move that post-it to next week. There's glitter vomiting on my page. It's like this glitter just went everywhere. This stuff seems to be staying, but this is like coming off in spades. Oh, uh, let's see. I'm a little concerned I'm not filming. I'm gonna check. It was filming, so there we go. I'm good. Uh, let's see, what else could I do? I want to get some just general to-do lists because I don't know what day we're doing things, but we need to get some things done. And this Paige Evans book has these like clipboardy looking things. And they're really skinny and really tall. Like they don't fit in, I guess they're not that skinny. I thought they were gonna be like, for some reason they don't, they look narrower than the box, but they're not, they fit but they're taller than the box. So I'm gonna use a periwinkle one. I'm gonna use a pink one. And I think I'm gonna use whatever color that is, turquoise, aqua. I don't know what color that is. Turquoise, aqua, that color. <laughs> and I just gotta figure out where I'm gonna put them. They're gonna, they can straddle days cause they're kinda generic to-dos for the whole of spring break. So I don't mind if they're not on a day, you know what I mean? So let's put one here and let it straddle that. And then let's slide one up here. Let it straddle those days. And then why don't we just have one for Saturday? Cause you know, Saturday. All right, I don't know. I've never really straddled. I, I'll like offset things a little, but I've never totally straddled a day. So this is kind of new for me, but I, I think it'll work. And then honestly, that's all I need to put down. Like I could be done. So I'm just gonna look through now and see if there's anything for fun I wanna put. Like these are cute as can be. Look at the bicycles. We don't have bicycles because we live like out in the country and you know, you can't ride on the side of the road or you'll get like <laughs> run over. But oh my gosh, these are so cute. I kind of want to put these somewhere. Oh, and that sticker, I pulled that up, remember? You guys almost let me forget that. Don't you love how I'm blaming you when you can't even talk? Where is it? Here it is. Now that I'm looking at this, is the light blue gonna work? Yeah, it'll work. I do like that they kind of design like everything to match in some of these books. Sometimes it bugs me because I feel like it limits me, but some other times like this, it's like done for me. I don't even have to think. Where can I put the cute little bicycles? They run into each other, so they're not facing the same way, which is kind of an issue. What if I put them on top of the game nights? I'm gonna cut off the bottom because it's a clear sticker and um, I want it to look like it's actually riding on top of that line. But if I put it over top of it, I won't be able to write in my box. Do you know what I mean? I want to be able to write in it. So just clip off the bottom of the clear sticker here. I do wish they were facing the same way, but I get why they designed them to go opposite ways. That's kind of cute. I don't know, it's busy, it's crazy, but it's cute. All right, what else was there in this book? To just play around with, I just get to play now. That's fall. Easter. 
Those match perfectly, but again, it's just a lot of stripes, and I don't need that. Might pull out a rainbow or two. Definitely rainbow season right now because of all the rain we're having and because it's spring and they're the right colors and they're so cute. Uh, where shall I put a sweet little rainbow? Probably can't. Let's see. I could still write something there. That's got a rainbow there. And I put one here. And stick one here. That'll work, right? Yeah. I still got another one. I might pull him out. I might not. More washi, but I think I'm I think I'm good on washi. Don't really need these guys. I don't really want florals. I know I've got this, but I just don't think I want more florals. I don't think. I might come back to it. And then these are a different colorway. These are the summer. So let's look in here and see if there's anything. Cute little bird, he's the right colors. But I would have put him over here and he's facing the wrong way, so I'm not gonna use him. I could use a quote, right? Enjoy the little thing, let me see what else there is before I start reading all of them. Feel beautiful today, that's really sweet. And the colors are great with this. I don't usually use something like that, but I think I love it. Messy bun, getting things done. That sounds like spring break, doesn't it? Okay, I know, spring break, most people like to travel, but we're still being careful for COVID. So we're not traveling, we're staying home. And I just want to be where you are. I like that, but it's the wrong, can you see it? It's the wrong color green. I really like that and could have, should have, would have put it where my son's free day is because I would love to be where he is and hang out with him on his free day, but it's a long way off, so I'm not. So let's see here. Messy buns, getting things done. Feel beautiful today. This might be too much because I do have quotes here. So I think I need to pick one or the other. Messy bun. Beautiful. Ah, whatever one I do, I think I'm gonna put over here on Monday because we're gonna take Monday easy because it's our first day of spring break and we're just gonna love it. I think I like this one. I think I do. That's sweet, right? So I'll put this guy back. And I'm pretty sure I can't get it back in the space. So I'm gonna take off this backing so I can just smack it down wherever it'll fit. That's a nice little tip for you that I love. Sometimes I'll go through the books and take off all the backings on the clear sticker desk pages just cause I can. Um, yeah, none of these are totally necessary, are they? I mean, this thing's cute, but is it necessary? No. Do I want to put it somewhere? Yes. I wish I had two, because then I'd put one under here, too. But I don't think there's another one. Sorry about my flipping. I mean, I could cut one out of one of these. I don't know that I trust myself to cut it well, though. Yeah, I don't think so. I think that was it. I like this sticker, this little coffee mug. Kind of like him. I do wish I had two of these, but I don't. Should I put that on just to be cute right under there? I don't know. Now I really do wish I had something under there. Do I need the coffee mug? Put that here, right? Maybe. Could put it there. I don't know. Maybe this is too much. It's so cute. I think it's too much. I'll figure out where he goes later and put him away. 
I'm regretting putting this because there's not one here. So I think I'm gonna pull that up. It just looks oddly unbalanced. You know what I can do instead? I know what I can do instead. Put that back. Remember this washi? Let's put a teeny bit of that down there. That'll work. And I'll even do like a cool torn edge. And I'll just make myself a little strip of that to put under there. Again, not necessary. Just kind of cute. Maybe it's kind of cute. I don't know. You guys think it's kind of cute or is it too much? I don't know. I don't know. Might be too much. What if it's narrower? So now I have this, which I think is really sweet. I think it's a nice width for what I'm wanting to do. So I'll just put that down there. I think it's cute. I'm just eyeballing it. It's not exact, which might bug some of you, but I'm okay with it and it's my planner. Now I want this scooted over. It's not quite centered enough. And I could put a little more. Where should I put some more? Should I put one under there? Above there? Or if I go above? No, that one's weird. I don't like that one. That didn't tear right. Uh, let's see. No, I want to put one under there. I don't know. Never know till I try it. And it's just washy, so it pulls up easy if I don't like it. I don't like it. I think just the two. I'm, I, I feel like... I think you need three of things for it to work, but I don't really have a good spot for a third, so... I'm going to put one here. What if I did that? If I try to make it a better edge. And I put it here. Do I like that? Again, it's just washy if I don't. What do we think of that? That's not horrible. Not horrible. Kind of think I want to put that last rainbow right there because I don't know what I'm saving it for. I'm never going to use just one random specifically colored rainbow. And it's fine because this is usually a running to-do list for the week, but I've got running to-do lists for the week, so this is fine. So there we go. This is my wild and crazy, maybe not best design, but best workable um, spring break spread. Now that I'm looking at it, this rose gold looks weird and oddly out of place, don't you think? And the florals. Yeah, so I'm gonna cut this out. It just looks odd. And then what it'll be is a white backed sticker, which I generally hate. But I'm gonna go with it today because it's spring break, right? Right? Right. And try it. And try to embrace the white backed sticker. And I think I'm gonna like this better. I think I'll pull it down a little further than it was too. It's crooked. It's crooked. You can't tell with the cursive letters, but you can tell with the the, uh, the bold printed letters. 
This is still gonna be crooked because I have a crooked eye. But I don't know, that sticker just looks out of place, but I'm gonna let it go for now. So thanks for watching. Um, I'd love a subscribe. I haven't gotten any new subscribers in a while, so if you're watching, please give me a subscribe. It'd be awesome. Um, if you like what you see, give me a like. If you've got something to tell me about, leave me a comment. And you can check me out at Ricky Mickey Plans over on Instagram if you want to. So thanks for watching. I hope I inspired you a little bit. And um, yeah, stay safe, stay healthy, and happy planning. Bye-bye.